Yes. So ladies, what I've asked you to do here is I've asked you to take one half and two fourths and four eighths and six twelfths and compare them. What would you do in that situation? Take one half, so pull one half out and set it aside. Now it's asking you to compare that to two fourths. So what would that mean? What does that mean two fourths? Don't worry, it can't see your face, it just hears your voice. What does two fourths mean? One out of four. Two fourths. So what would that mean? If you had to grab two fourths, I see Teresa's trying to give you a hint here, I'll just kind of point at it. What does that mean? One, two fourths. What does that mean? Yeah, two out of four. Two out of four. So there was two out of four that made up the what? What would happen if I had four fourths? What would that equal? Four out of four, and that would equal what? It equals one of these guys, which is what? One what? One whole. Okay, cool. I'll take it. So it equals one whole. But I don't want four fourths. I'm asking you to compare half to two fourths. So if you put those two together, what do you what do you get? What, what's what happened there? You get yeah. They're they're both one half for sure. And how do you know they're both one half? Let's call on you for this one. How do you know they're both one half? Because the, when you say the same thing, what does that mean? Same size. All right. Okay. So now, what if we took four eighths? So these red guys. Take four of those four of those red guys. One third. Oh, it's not the same color. That's a, it. Doesn't matter. They're all the same size. And we're gonna compare them. All right. Now, when it's gonna be really tough to yeah, that's I was gonna say it's gonna be really really tough to compare them if they're just in a piece pieces like that. So let's let's take these and let's move them underneath. And then if we put them together, try to eliminate all those spaces, what do we notice about four eighths? Four eighths is also the same size. So is it possible for us to say four eighths is the same as two fourths? Yeah. Is the same as one half. So that is equal to both of those? Oh, all right, all right. Now, what if we even went smaller? What if we went to the twelfths? So we're going to grab these little blue pieces, and I want six of those. Let's see what happens. What do you think is going to happen? What do you think is going to happen? I'll grab you some extra. All right, so, so I'll grab some extra ones there. All right, so we've got six twelfths now, four eighths, two quarters, and one half. What do we notice about all of those? They're all the same size. So if you happen to see a fraction that looks like that, what will you think of then? That you're gonna think of one half. All right, cool, I like that, excellent work.